Hello friends hope you all are doing well as the world is being battered with corona virus with total cases over 13 million and deaths over half a million we are put into unending cycles of lockdown and social distancing and we are bound to think is this the worst year to be alive is the doomsday coming close it started with bush fires in early 2020 then covid then extending on to two cyclones over india and locust attacks today i am going to relieve some of your worries with facts this is not the first time humanity is facing such a crisis all of us know about black death of 14th century precisely 1347 to 1351 due to the bubonic plague when almost half of the population of europe was exterminated it took until 1500 for the europe population to regain that of 1300 in the same breath i would like to add about the ninth biblical plague of egypt then lord said to moses stretch out your hand towards the sky so that darkness that can be felt total darkness covered egypt for 3 days no one could see anyone else or leave his place for 3 days exodus 10:21 to 23 friends think what you may but by far the worst time ever noted in the human history would definitely be 536 AD when much of the world went into full darkness for a full 18 months as a mysterious fog rolled over Europe then extending over Middle East and parts of Asia the fog blocked the sun during the day the crops failed and people died due to low temperatures a volcanic eruption in the iceland in early 530 helped spread the ash across the northern hemisphere creating the fog a situation quite similar to that of 1815 mount tambora eruption the deadliest volcanic eruption causing global climatic change for years that caused global famine So how did this 18 months of darkness look like Byzantine historian Procopius wrote The sun gave forth its light without brightness like moon during this whole year He also said that the sun was constantly in eclipse and this time was the peak of war pestilence and other things which led to death in 1990s michael mccormick a history professor at the harvard and a co-author of antiquity paper wrote that researchers examined tree rings and found something weird happened around 536 ad the summers in europe and asia became 35 to 37 degree fahrenheit colder or at least 3 degree celsius colder and china reported summer snow this age was called the late antique little ice age mccormick says it was a pretty drastic change and it happened overnight a roman politician Cassiodorus wrote We marvel to see no shadows of our bodies at noon He also wrote sun had a bluish color and the moon had lost its luster all the seasons seemed jumbled up 536 AD was compounded by eruptions in 540 and 547 AD and it took a long time for the northern hemisphere to recover 
so much so that this little ice age lasted till 680 AD. The period of cold and starvation led to a great economic slowdown, which was complicated by the first bubonic plague of 541, which battered the Europe's population and killed almost one third to half of the Europe's population. But better times came even then, albeit after a long wait of around 150 years. So we sincerely hope that this pandemic will end soon and we will have a bright sunshine falling upon us. Bye guys, see you in our next video. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to our channel if you have liked the video. Bye.